It's your birthday. It's your birthday. Bad bitch contest. You in first place. It's your birthday. It's your birthday. Bad bitch contest. You in first place. Hi, my loves. So as usual, I'm priming my eyes before I apply my eyeshadow and I'm using the LA Girl Pro Concealer in Natural. And I'm taking the shade Caramel from the Amrezy palette and I'm gonna use that as like my starting transition shade. Then I'm taking that purple um, color tattoo. I can't think of the name right now, but I'm using that as a base because I'm gonna take Iridescent Purple from that same palette and I'm gonna place that on top. So I'm just going to pack that color onto the lid until it's nice and um, pigmented and then like I said I'm going to take the eyeshadow and place it right over top and again build up the color and the intensity and then I'm going to blend it out with a brown and like kind of red brown um, crease color. Okay, so I'm applying the same foundation I used in my latest video, the Maybelline Dream Matte Velvet Hydrating Foundation, or Hydrating Matte Foundation, and I really like it, but anyways, I'm applying one layer of that, and I'm buffing it out with a buffer brush, a flat top, buff a flat top buffer brush, but I must say, I do kind of like the way that it applies better with a beauty blender, so I need to wash my brushes so that I can, um, you know, use it, but... I'm just blending it down my neck so that it doesn't look like I have a mask on. And to highlight my face, I'm using the Maybelline Fit Me Concealer, which I've forgotten about. And I absolutely love this stuff. I don't know. I've been using my um, the LA Girl Pro Concealer a lot lately. So I'm just applying it in all the areas that I want highlighted. Um, I don't know if you guys can hear. I have Aaliyah in my lap, of course. But yeah, I'm just applying that to my highlighted areas and I'm blending it out with a beauty sponge and I'm actually using it dry because I forgot to wet it
And so I'm using two separate setting powders to set my highlights. I'm using the Sasha Cosmetics and the Cody Airspun. And I like to mix them. I just feel like it just looks a lot more flawless and not cakey. Um, so yeah, I'm putting those onto my face and I am making sure I blend them out very nicely. Applying the um, powder on um, my skin where I want to look more highlight. I'm sorry, the yellow powder. Um, but yeah, lately I've been loving to use those two powders mixed together and it looks very nice. So on days when I don't feel like contouring, you guys, because I don't ever really feel like contouring, and my cheekbones are so pronounced, I don't really have to. I just like to bronze up my face with the Turks and Caicos um, bronzer from e.l.f. and it's amazing. So I'm just using that to sort of warm my face up and then I'm going to apply my blush and my highlight. And the highlight that I'm using is from e.l.f. you guys, it's called Pink Tastic, and it's actually a baked blush. So I really couldn't decide on the lip color I wanted to go with, so I went with Beeper from ColourPop. It's just like my favorite, favorite color of life right now. And I just paired Stingray over top, and yeah, that's basically it that completed the look. So I hope you guys really enjoyed this video, and don't forget to subscribe if you already haven't, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye, guys.